All right, it's five o'clock in the morning. Like everybody else, I'm up dry firing. Um, and I was thinking about this reloading thing, and uh, it keeps being mentioned that it's more efficient. And, and the theory is, like, as you grab your mag, right, you just come up to the gun with the bullets backwards, and you don't have to rotate your wrist versus when the bullets are forward. You're doing this, so that's the efficiency you're getting rid of. Is this like I've got to move the mag like two feet and while I'm doing it I have to rotate my wrist right so that's what you're getting rid of is that little bit of rotation of just going into the gun the thing that is the there's more to the that reload that USCCA is the one who I know teaches it right they have you bring the gun in close to your chest right and then you follow the contour of your body up and insert the magazine so if we look at the efficiency of it I'm going to reload my gun right here I do have to rotate my wrist, right? But if we watch like how much my elbow moves going from here to there, right? Like that's all it really needs to move is a few inches. I think sometimes I drop my elbow, insert the mag, so now it's moving farther. But that's all it's doing. If you watch my shoulder, it's not really moving at all. If I show it to you. Right, that was terrible, but you get the idea, right? Watching the shoulder and the elbow. It doesn't move a whole lot, right? Now, pull it backwards. Gone in close to my chest, watch how far my elbow moves. All right, so it went from here all the way to there as I insert it. Pull it backwards. Watch my shoulder. It drops, right? So I'm moving, I'm using more muscles. I'm moving farther it's not more efficient because you're doing more things to accomplish the same. Like, it's just not. So I think that's a big part of the difference. Like, really, it's where you reload and how you reload that's making it slower. The bullet direction is really a small part of what makes that less efficient.